that's better. <laughs> now I can see the tops of the covers. Ah, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> see the quilt properly okay so I might just turn that there okay and I will um, put some other pictures up during the day Facebook people so don't worry <laughs> shall we do the next one let your arms more like Brenda. Yes. <laughs> I did do that one. Nice. I did enjoy that one. Nice. I, I, like I know it's a bit scary, isn't it? I feel very unfaithful. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, there is another one that Brenda's doing, which is in her hand. So this is the French General. Oh, it's oh, nice. So I actually yeah. used that as my main... Oh, oh, I said I talked to the top this morning. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That was the one I really used for the main design. That's when I, the first one I showed you, wasn't it? It was, yeah. yeah. I fell in love with the French general. Beautiful. I love that pink in that moment. Yeah. Great. Yeah. Great. Yeah. Great. Yeah. Great. Yeah. Great. Great. Yeah. Great. 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 Great.
girls didn't actually have the instructions when they were putting those together, they just had a picture. So I've made it really clear in the instructions. When you're putting this section on here, you see how this kind of looks like it's overlapping? Yeah. So there's a little bit here to stick on the end of these rectangles. Ah. And then there's this corner here goes onto these. And so this seam doesn't match up with anything. So don't expect it to match up with anything. Don't but I have to put that anything. quite clearly, I think, in the instructions. And I did a little sort of plain up diagram as well. So there we go. So in the in the single one, yes, um, we haven't got the hexagonal. Right, you don't have the hexagonal. So you've got this that. here, but your rectangles are smaller. Right. So they go on here. Yeah. 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 And then you've and got then these go yeah. around. Yeah. yeah. And then your final borders are just top and bottom borders. Right. Yeah. And then king size have got this border, this border, then you've got your flying geese, and then you've got another border that goes outside that. Wow. Wow. Oh, I mean, that just looks huge. Border. It's a hundred, and, hundred inches square, the king size. Oh. So that's just about the right size for a, a normal size backing. So your 108 inch backings will be great. For really good. Mm -hmm. That's quite a big bunch of ideas. Yeah, that's not bad. <laughs> so, we'll be, um, so we're going to Brenda and... Um, so just to, just to ask, yes. do we start in the middle and work out? Yes. Okay. Right. I just need to know. I mean, you can start Stupid making new rows if you want to. No, but could. You just want to, with your um, hexagons and with your stars and your windmills, you want to kind of... Spread arrange them. them in four rows where you like the arrangement of them because you've got kind of different fabrics in there. Um, so yeah, so I did that. So like yeah, with the tube of pink. So all the windmilly ones are kind of purpley, but they're they're all different. So it's just balancing those out, and then mm. you've got you might not have all the same in each row. Um, but the nice star ones are. Green. Yeah. Yeah. So it varies with the different colourways. And the other thing to watch is which side of these, if you've got two different fabrics on these, yes. I've, told, I've given you a list of what goes next to this border, and then on here, which one goes next to here. I, I, I was, was fascinated by all the different little bits that had the, yeah. had the matching corners on it, and I'm thinking, yeah. God, I, I tried to think about how it would go, and it's nothing like that. <laughs> <laughs> nothing like that. Yeah. 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 It's, it's going to get a really nice length, really, really nice length. It's been a bit hard work, eh? Hey? <laughs> and so um, this year has been. Yeah, so we are actually going to take a little break from cutting mysteries. <laughs> We're going to do our next mystery will be like, like the original ones and it, but it'll start in July so we'll be doing sign-ups in June uh, May or June and but I do have another project for you <laughs> which will be probably announcing in December or January but you'll have to do some cutting for that. I was going to say it's, it's quite different. Cutting. <laughs> it's quite different. Out your packs. I'm just going to stop the Facebook Live and see if anybody's panicking on there. Hello, everybody. <laughs> Thanks for coming, everybody, live. And uh, yeah, have fun stitching, and we'll catch up with you later. We'll post some photos.